Hello, welcome to another unboxing video and quick capture because I don't like editing. <laughs> and I'm not kidding when I say that editing is literally the barrier to making good videos. And I know that if I could put in the work that I could have amazing videos, but A, I need to learn Photoshop and B, I need to find a job, guys. It's way more important for Jen to have a job. I know I could I could I could do the YouTube thing full time probably, but I would it would be a struggle for the first couple of years, and I don't know that I'm willing to struggle anymore. Anyway, um, enough 40 seconds of, of wallowing. Um, I'm doing an unboxing video for the new Wizarding World box. I have no idea what's in it. I have not been spoiled, which is a small miracle, because I have a friend whose initials are SF, and he knows who he is, that literally always gets the box before me somehow. It always puts pictures or video or something on the internet. Uh, don't get me wrong, I love this person very, very much, but it's kind of a Debbie Downer because I don't, I don't want to not know what's in it. Okay, enough, 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 whatever. So it's a much tinier box. As you can see, it's like really tiny. This is the tiniest one that they've ever sent us. Um, and I'm kind of freaking out because and I wish, I wish you could see, I, I wish this, that you could remove these stickers, but look at this cool sticker, right? It's, it's the three, uh, the three wands. I think it's the wands of the trio and it's like a tattoo and it says until the very end. I'm going to somehow try to remove that or video or photograph it or something, or maybe find the original image. I don't know, but I saw a video of someone doing an unboxing of these boxes and she said, oh, I think it would be great if those stickers were savable. I agree. So count that as two people who want the boxes to have stickers that are reusable. Anyway, two minutes of waiting. You don't have to wait any longer. Here we go. Ooh, <gasps> the Weasley clock. Oh my god. Okay, the inside of the boxes is just as cool as the rest of as the rest of the box. And I know that's like the lamest thing ever. Um. Okay. There's a T-shirt. And it looks like, it looks like the frickin', oh my god, it looks like the Black Family Tapestry on a t-shirt. Oh my god. Or it's the Black Family Tapestry on a tapestry. Guys, if that's what I think it is, I'm gonna freak out because I have a black, I have a signed print of the Black Family Tapestry by the people that designed it. And if this is just a tapestry, it's going up on the wall. Like, I have a blank wall right now. It's going up on the wall. Uh, awesome. I don't right now have a house shy, so this is really great. I don't, I, I, obviously there's things I could wear this tie to, but I have no idea. I'm definitely Ravenclaw and Clay, that wasn't clear. Um, really happy to get a house tie. It's really, really beautiful. Um, and very, very, I'm going to take it out of the plastic, actually, if I can, really quick. Um, where is the plastic? Okay, so it starts over here. I can only do this one-handed because I do not have a tripod and I am not willing to make myself wait. Oh my God. Okay, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna take a, take a snippy snip. No, I'm not gonna cut the tie. Thank you very much for stating the obvious. Okay, I just, just snipped a little side. Snipped a little side portion. Ah! I'm trying, guys. One-handed stuff is not good. All right. Here, let's see. Can I use it with the pop socket? No, no. If I do that, if I do that, does it do it? Here you go. All right. <laughs> I put, I put it in. I put my phone inside the box, <laughs> and I will also obviously take out whatever is in the other thing. So it has this little, nice little t, this tie, tie holder in the back that says Ravenclaw. That's really nice. I noticed that it doesn't have a Ravenclaw thing on the front, which I'm totally okay with. Can you see the thing? Yeah, see, now I'm backlit, so I'm going to pick, pick this back up again. But, like, I'm kind of glad. It's a tie that can be used as a tie. You know? It's a tie that can be used as a tie, and it's not, like, it doesn't scream Harry Potter on the front or doesn't have some sort of secret Harry Potter print on it. But that's, like, a that's like an adult-sized tie. That's, like, a decent... That's a decent-sized tie. Yeah. No, that's a nice tie. Um, so yeah, there's, there's a really nice house tie for you. And it's got two shades of the, of the gray. So it's got a thin light gray and a thick 
darker gray. I know you can't really tell in this light. Um, but obviously I like gray. Hello, my bedspread. Um, okay. I'm going to leave that to the last. And I think uh, the, few, the other person who I know has a thing. Um, I'm about to freak out because there's a book in here. I've, we've, there's never been a book in here before. It says... From the films of Harry Potter, the wand collection. If this is like a key to all the wands in the entire book, into the entire story, the the films, that's really freaking cool. Especially if it goes into, oh, it just says Harry Potter, so maybe it won't have the Fantastic Beast wands. Oh my god, it's everyone's wand. And it tells you the story of every single person. Is it, is it like separated? Okay, so here's all the students, right? There's Alfie, uh, Alfie Enoch. I know I, I can't call him Dean Thomas because he's Alfie Enoch because of how, how to get away with murder. Um, yeah, literally every single person's wand. High def pictures. Where was this when we were making Aura's Tale? Like, for real, though. Ron Weasley ha has had three. He's had three different wands. Get right out of town with the spell tape. There's Harry Potter. Are these the wands in order of appearance, Maybe. Maybe. Maybe they are the ones in order of appearance. <gasps> Mundungus Fletcher's wand. So I'm I'm assuming that you can get every single one of these. Like they're all available to you. I have this one. I have this one. It's lovely. Um, yeah, I'm assuming you can buy all of these. I'm assuming that there's a thing in the back. <gasps> Ooh, the Lucius Malfoy. Oh my god, it folds out like a centerfold. That's sexy. I know people who have this one as well. Um, yes. The Malfoy family. Uh, there's Narcissus with the be with the beads on the outside. I like that one as well. Yeah, uh, Ollivander's wand. I've never actually looked at Ollivander's wand. Look at this. And then here's the here's the three wands: Voldemort, Harry, and the Elder Wand. Look at that conclusion. You want magic to be real in life, says David Thewlis. Yes, I do. I do want it to be real in life. And this is the index. <gasps> Even Hagrid gets a shout out. Look at that. Okay, I'm freaking out. I'm really happy, guys. This is a really cool thing. Honestly, I have so many Harry Potter related books. I have a couple of film film related books and archives and stuff. But this is really cool. Every wand has a story of its own. Is this a Loot Crate exclusive? It's a Loot Crate edition. So maybe this is a book that already exists. Someone can tell me if this book already exists. But yeah, Harry Potter the Wand Collection is a visual guide to these magical wands, their makers, and the characters who mastered them. <gasps> this is really cool. I'm really into the artifacts, and I'm really into the wands. And I've met the guy who designed the Elder Wand. I had him sign my Elder Wand, because I'm crazy. Um, which is the, the wand that you can use at the park that makes things, like, move. Um, it is obviously now going to stay in its box and not go to the park ever again. The next time I go to the park, I'll probably buy another wand. Because um, that's my problem. But yeah, this is really lovely from Hermione Granger's elegant vine wrapped wand. All right, I'm I'm into eight minutes now, so I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna move on. I want to open this since I figured out a way to open the first thing. I want to open this thing, and if it's what I think it is, if it's not a shirt, I mean I'm okay with it not being a shirt. If I, if that wasn't clear, um, it looks like a Black Family tapestry. If it's a full Black Family tapestry, it probably was the greatest decision I could have made to not cancel the loot crate. Um, so yeah, I don't have a job right now. And I kept the loot crate going because I want to collect all of the pins, which yes, there is a pin in here and we're going to get to it. But, oh my God, is it a scarf? If it's a scarf, I'm not going to, I'm not going to wear it like ever. Okay. I think it's a scarf. <gasps> oh my God, I'm going to cry. I'm going to cry. You guys have no idea. I cried when I saw this at the studio tour. It says one size fits most. So I'm assuming it is a scarf, but... Am I ever going to wear it as a scarf? No fucking way. Sorry, forget part of my French. No freaking way am I going to wear this as a scarf. In in no world, in no world would this ever be worn as a scarf. I am going to cry. Oh my God, it's the full thing. And you can see the dates. Oh my God, Sirius 1845-1853. The first Sirius, not the second Sirius, who obviously gets his face burnt out. Um, spoiler alert. Um... I am gonna freak out. Okay, I need now need to see if it's the full, like if it has the door. Because the whole thing with the No, seriously though, the whole thing with the with the Black Family Tapestry is that 
there was a print that you could buy that didn't have the door on it. Then there was a print that you could buy that had the door on it, but it was a miniaturized print, so you couldn't see everything. So I have the print from inside of, I think, the Artifact Vault book, possibly, I'm not sure, 100%. So now the key, the key question is, can you see the door? Or does it cut off where the door would have been? Because the whole thing about it is that it, this, is a, this is a piece of wallpaper. <gasps> oh my god, this is so going up on my wall. Oh, I don't want to put any holes in it though. <gasps> I'm going to cry. This is amazing. When I put this up on my wall, I'm going to cry. Okay, so there's no door. I'm assuming I'm going to have to figure out if it ends where the same things end. It's obviously licensed. It's obviously a Loot Crate. It's, it might not be a Loot Crate exclusive. I don't think it is a Loot Crate exclusive, but I mean, we'll find out when I read the little thingy at the end. <gasps> but it's huge. Guys, in no world would I probably wear this as a scarf. And I love scarves. So you have to imagine. This is, this is my dream. This is my dream. This is everything I've ever wanted in life. Is to have a, a life-size version of this. Obviously, I would rather have it be like wall-sized. But this is freaking great. <gasps> I'm so happy. Okay, so I'm gonna put this away now because I'm gonna freak out some more. Um, and now I have to open up the last thing, which is clearly the most important, even though that thing is pretty hard to freaking top. Um, let's see if I can do this. I'm like, just hold yourself up. Do, do, do. Okay, so I'm opening this up really quick. Do, do, do. Harry Potter, right, of course. Duh, always Harry Potter. Um, I mean, what else, what else are we dealing with here? Alright. Okay. So, here's hoping. This is another in the Horcrux collection. So we've had the cup, the ring, the diary, and the locket. I don't think we've had a fifth one. Don't quote me on that. There may be five, not four. I'm trying to remember. Okay, wait. <laughs> I don't think I could do this. The cup, the locket, the diary, the ring. Wait, cup, diary, locket, ring. There was another one, and I can't remember. Well, anyway, hopefully this is the diadem. <gasps> it is! Yes! So obviously this is the Ravenclaw one, so it's the most important to me. That is really pretty. I probably should have edited this video. Oh, you can even see, like in great super detail the stuff that says it I can't read it I can't read it through the camera lens uh yeah I can't read what it says but it's really freaking beautiful it says something 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 I'm really bad I can't read it but it's really fucking beautiful and it's obviously an eagle and it's obviously the diadem and it's really freaking pretty ah Really glad I didn't get rid of the friggin' Loot Crate, guys. This was a long video. It's gonna take forever to upload. But I'm very happy. Um, let's see what the thing says. The thing you always get at the end. Uh, this is called The Ties That Bind. Um, this box is called The Ties That Bind. No matter the bloodline, family ties run deep in the wizarding world. With this crate, explore some of the heirlooms and traditions passed through generations, connecting people together or sometimes driving them apart. Okay. And then, yeah, so you get, obviously, a tie, as in the ties that bind. Oh, somewhere on that tie, there was a little, there must have been an eagle. I don't see an eagle. I legitimately do not see an eagle. It's supposed to be on there, like, hiding? Oh, there it is! So, yeah, it's very subtle. I didn't even see that. Super subtle. Um, so yeah, you get a Hogwarts house tie, which is exclusive item only available here. You get the, the Ravenclaw diadem pin. Um, yeah, this Horcrux series, the Horcrux series continues with this exclusive pin. So the, the, these pins you can only get through the box unless you find them on the internet. Ooh, yes. And then what else is left? The wand book. Wand book. Receiving a wand is an important step in each in each wizard's life. Da, 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 da. In this Loot Crate edition wand book, explore some of the most famous wands in the wizarding world and the wizards they chose. Um, okay, so it says that the Black Family Tree Tapestry Shawl slash Scarf is in fact a Loot Crate exclusive. Um, that's going to be on eBay for a f, f ton of money and I shouldn't swear anymore. 
Um, but yeah, it was a small box. I, I would love to know what, what, what was it that held this box up? It couldn't be the, the pin, could it? Or maybe they really wanted to have the, the, the tapestry scarf thing. I do not want to wear this as a scarf and I love scarves. I'm really, really into this. I would have, I would pay $40 for this. That's insane. That's, I'm just, I'm in love with this thing. Okay. I've been making this video for 15 minutes. It has gone on way too long. I'm so much happier that now that this has come, I don't know how I'm going to pay for the next one. Hopefully, but hopefully I can complete this set of Horcrux pins that I don't need to cancel. But I'm freaking out because that's, this is probably my, one of my favorite items I've ever gotten in a crate. Because I love the Black Family and I love the tapestry. Um, yeah, I'm done. 16 minutes is too long, so we should just cut this off now. All right, I love you all. Thank you for watching. I hope you are getting this box in the mail. Bye.